the Human Being Art Project, when Betty first explained it to me and I read it, the curriculum and everything, I was on board. I was there because you can see the collaboration within them. Several of them have helped one person make their, pro make their project. So it's not a self situation, it's a selfless situation. They are behaving like brothers and sisters in harmony. Hey Ugly is almost like an empowerment to show you that even the bad things in people can turn out to be something good. So today I really think that, you know, it's about unity and coming together no matter what race, you know, height, weight, eye color, hair color, it doesn't matter. You, we're all unique, but we're all the same in the fact that we're one population and we're one group that needs to be united in our small little different ways. And having them here reinforces their relationships, strengthens their commitment to one another to work together, and that's what this is all about. Students from the Midwest came together to participate in Hey Ugly's Human Being Art Project, a project that asked students to draw images of all people living together in harmony. So what does the Human Being Art Project hope to achieve? I think that it can open their minds to be able to see their fellow human being as someone that they can live in life with in a harmonious way instead of looking at them and judging them based on something superficial like our skin. Come on this way guys, come on this way. We asked the kids the most important thing to talk about the things that human beings have in common. Okay, make a circle. We all have emotions, we all have hopes and dreams and feelings that get hurt when we get bullied. I don't want you standing next to your friends. I want you to stand next to somebody you're not familiar with. Do that. If you've got long sleeves on, pull your sleeves up. Up to your elbows. Okay, kind of make a circle around Mr. Rick here. Okay, I want you guys to look around at each other and notice how much alike we are. Now, I want you guys to stand close to each other and I'm gonna step back a little bit and I want you each next to the other to put your arm next to the person that's right next to you. Well, we stood next to each other with our arms out and pretty much just compared like our skin colors and like where we came from. Everybody slide together. I want everybody's arm touching somebody else. Okay? Take a look at the different hues in your skins. Most of us think we're Caucasian, Latino, combination, multi-race. My parents are from Europe. Look at how similar, yet how different we are from one another. What's the one absolute thing that everyone in this circle has in common? It was almost like this weird, like, it was like an electrical impulse or something. It was just, it's something just clicked. Ooh, new best friends. Yeah, it was just like, <laughs> you knew what to feel around them, like not to be nervous to get to know them or anything. It just felt like you knew them. I think it just shows you that everyone was unique. Like, all the, yeah, I didn't know the people I was standing by, but like I instantly felt a connection with them because we were standing there. I love that feeling when I get around people that I'm just meeting, in, but they still feel like I've known them forever. You are selected by the gifts you possess, the gifts you share every day with your fellow classmates, with your teachers, with each other. And we all have eyes, hearts, lungs, and skin. It's just hued variously. So that's the Human Being Art Project.